this is the first year man of us. Fans, please join me in welcoming to the field the 2021 Saline High School Marching Band. celebration. We are pleased to welcome all Selene alumni, students, staff, administration, community members, and guests back home for the festivities. The Selene Area Schools family is proud of its heritage and is thrilled to present this homecoming show based on those traditions. To all alumni, welcome home. To kick off tonight's program, we'd like to thank the 170 members Selene High School Marching Band. Under the direction of Mr. Nate Landman, Ben Reed, Scott Cannell, Rebecca Allman, and featuring drum majors Cora Hart and Kira Schaefer. They will be performing their halftime show, dance show, during their post-game performance. Thank you, Celine High School Marching Band, for providing the backdrop for tonight's crowning. And a very special thank you to our Celine High School drum line for your participation today for Spirit Day. You have created a new tradition at Celine High School. A special thank you also goes out to class advisors, our freshman advisors, Sarah Stuckey and Melanie Scott, our sophomore advisors, Brandon Smith and Gina Panzica, our junior advisors, Holly Neeb and Audra Lucas, and our senior advisors, Mike Hill and Jason Schmier. A thank you also goes out to Celine High School Principal David Raft, SWWC Director Dr. Ryan Rowe, Assistant Principals Joe Pelka, Teresa Steger, and Musetta Deneen, Athletic Director Andrew Parrish, Dean of Students Jen Bernard, Custodial Staff, our Security Team, Secretaries, IT Department, and all of the other support staff for your help with the activities and events this week. And finally, the biggest thank you goes to our Student Council Advisors, Lori Dawson, Alyssa Dawson, and the Student Council without whom all of the events of this week, including Spirit Week, the parade, and tomorrow's dance would not be possible. Fans, please help me say thank you by joining in a round of applause. And now, the 2021 Homecoming Court has assembled on the field. The court comprises representatives from each class, nominated by their peers, the homecoming court was selected by the entire student body through voting this week. Students were asked to nominate two peers, and the students with the most votes were appointed to homecoming court. All of these students are honored tonight for their school spirit, friendliness, enthusiasm, and participation at school. First, representing the freshman class of 2025 is Madeline Brennan and Zach Fritz. Madeline Brennan is a freshman at Celine High School and is being escorted by her parents, Robin Lindsay Brennan. Madeline's favorite subjects are math, health and fitness, and biology. Outside of school, Madeline has been playing soccer since she was three and now plays travel soccer for Celine FC. She recently started learning martial arts at Celine ATA. 
In her free time, Madeline enjoys spending time outside with her family and friends, swimming, hunting, fishing, and playing basketball. Madeline is honored to be representing the class of 2025 and wants to thank everyone who gave her this opportunity tonight. Zach Fritz. Zach is a freshman at Celine High School and is being escorted by his mom, Sarah Fritz. Zach's favorite subjects in school are math and PE, and Zach plays baseball, football, and basketball. Outside of school and sports, he enjoys fishing. Zach is very happy to be a part of homecoming court and is very grateful for the opportunity his classmates, classmates have given him. Congratulations to both Maddie and Zach. Representing the sophomore class in 2024 is Laney Miller and CJ Carr. Laney Miller is being escorted by her parents, Wes and Jenny Miller. She participates in student council, volunteers as a tutor for elementary students, and dances at Dance Alliance and LA Dance Magic. Her favorite classes at Celine are French, English, and A-Push. In her free time, she enjoys hanging out with friends, family, and her dog, Gus. Laney would like to thank Mr. Raft, Mrs. Dawson, and the entire homecoming committee for a fun and memorable week of festivities. CJ Carr. CJ is currently preparing for the second half of tonight's game. His parents are representing him tonight. Jason and Tammy Carr. And CJ has two brothers, Tommy and his guardian angel, Chad. CJ's goal is to play Division I football in college. And he also enjoys playing baseball and basketball. His favorite classes at Celine are history, English, and gym. In his free time, he enjoys watching sports, playing video games, and hanging out with friends and family. CJ would like to thank everyone who voted for him, and also everyone who was involved in planning this year's homecoming celebration. Congratulations to Laney and CJ. Representing the junior class of 2023 is Emma McDonald and Ian McNaughton. Emma McDonald is being escorted by her parents, Tina and Mike McDonald. Emma is an organized and dedicated student while also participating on the track team. She competes in the pole vault and sprints. Her favorite class is the one she is currently in with Mr. Zire, which is Human Body Systems. Emma intends to go to Michigan State University to pursue a career in the medical field. She currently works at the local Celine Dairy Queen and also babysits. In her free time, she loves hanging out with family and friends, fishing with her brother and dad, camping, shopping with her mom and friends, and sailing on her boat. She's very excited to represent her junior class on the homecoming court. Next, Ian McNaughton. Ian is being escorted by his parents, Dugold and Tiffany McNaughton. Ian is a trumpet player in the concert and jazz bands and a squad leader in the marching band. Ian enjoys golf, hanging out with his friends, and traveling with family. His favorite classes include history and computer science, and he plans to study cybersecurity in college. Ian is honored to represent the junior class in this year's homecoming court. Congratulations to Emma and Ian. And now it's time to introduce the homecoming court for the senior class of 2022. First, Quinn Allman. Quinn is being escorted by their parents, Craig and Deanna Allman. Quinn is a bright-minded student with a desire to spread positivity. Every day they strive to make people feel included and appreciated. You're most likely to find Quinn near a piano or guitar writing new songs and creating different melodies. Quinn loves to share their creative projects with others and is determined to use their skills to dominate their future in TV and film industry. Keep a look for this familiar face on the big screen. Quinn was a member of the All-State Honors Choir during freshman year and is the current leader of Ten Tones, a top-tier a cappella group here at Celine. Quinn is also the student director of the Chamber Choir. And next we have Donovan Shambell. Donovan is a senior at Celine High School and is being escorted by his parents, Stephanie Zilweger and Ron Shambell. At school, he enjoys taking the auto tech class with Mr. Tomosik. On the football team, he plays middle linebacker and is looking forward to the rest of his senior season with the team. In the spring, Donovan will be playing defense for the varsity lacrosse team. 
When he's not at practice, he spends most of his time hanging out with friends. Donovan is thankful to be on the homecoming court and can't wait to see what the rest of the year has in store. And next, Olivia Dibley. <laughs> Olivia is being escorted by her parents, Sherry and Mike Dibley. Her favorite classes are visual imaging, technology, and careers in education. Outside of school, she is busy with her competitive dance schedule. She's been dancing for almost 15 years and is excited to have just begun her final season at her studio. When she isn't in dance, she enjoys baking. Over the summer, Olivia had a successful online business selling cakes and cupcakes. In her free time, she loves to spend time with her family and friends. She is so grateful to be nominated for Homecoming Queen because she wants to make her senior year as memorable as possible. Next, we have Greta McIntyre. <laughs> Greta is being escorted by her parents, Phil and Lisa McIntyre. Greta is an active member of the National Honor Society, Ping Pong Club, and the marching band where she plays piccolo. She enjoys traveling with her family, reading, playing the flute, and spending time outside. She's looking forward to the rest of her senior year and hopes to pursue a degree in neuroscience after graduation. Next up, Daniel Popa. Daniel is being escorted by his parents, Liana and Paul Popa. Daniel is a first-generation American, an artist, and has lived in the Saline School District his entire life. He is honored to represent not only his class, but all students. With a sincere appreciation for music and other forms of art, he has been playing the saxophone for eight years and finds pride in conveying his music at his church. You may also know Daniel for his artwork of both Harriet Tubman and Martin Luther King, which is hung up in the commons every year during Black History Month. Daniel hopes to make a positive impact during his time here at Celine High School. Next, Avery St. Lawrence. Avery is a senior at Celine High School and is being escorted by her parents, Trish and Matt St. Lawrence. She's involved in numerous clubs, including NHS, Key Club, and Link Crew. Avery looks forward to finishing up high school and hopefully attending her dream school, the University of Notre Dame. One of her biggest dreams in life is to watch the Minion movie with NBA Youngboy. And her favorite teacher of all time, Mr. Schmier. Next up, we have Hayden Shad. Hayden is being escorted by his parents, Joel and Sarah Shad. Hayden has enjoyed being a four-year four member of the marching band where he plays trumpet and has served as squad leader for the past two years. Hayden is also a member of the track and cross-country teams. He's a member of the Boy Scout Troop 457 and is currently pursuing the rank of Eagle Scout. Hayden enjoys volunteering at church, golfing, and spending time camping and visiting national parks with his family and dog Wrigley. He looks forward to the rest of his senior year and hopes to pursue a degree in engineering. And last, we have Adam Singer. Adam is being escorted by his parents, David Singer and Sharon Kilenny. Adam is one of the many seniors on the wrestling team and hopes to place at the state tournament this year. He's looking forward to completing high school and is hoping to attend the University of Michigan. His other interests involve playing the guitar and hanging out with friends. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it once again for all of our class representatives in 2021 Homecoming Quotes. Crowning this year's Homecoming Royalty is our 2020 Homecoming Queen, Ava Ignacio, and Haley Malinzak, our Miss Celine. Thank you both for taking part in tonight's celebration. And now, with no further ado, we would like to congratulate our 2020-2021 Homecoming Royalty. Olivia Dimley and Donovan Shambell.
Congratulations once again, Olivia and Donovan. And current students, please join us tomorrow night at 8.30 p.m. for our homecoming dance at Hornet Stadium. The theme for this year is Enchanted Forest. Tickets are available online through RevTrack. Thank you and congratulations to all students for showing your Hornet pride during homecoming week 2021 and enjoy the rest of the game.